So many times in sports, you've seen the whole father coaching the son situation. But on UNO's campus, it's a little bit of a different twist. Brother coaching brother. We're talking about UNO baseball coach Blake Dean coaching his younger brother, Dakota Dean. One word to describe coaching your brother. Interesting. <laughs> tough. Why? Because sometimes he's more tough on me than others. It's certainly going to be a tough and interesting adjustment for both guys, especially Dakota. Just him telling me what to do and what not to do, you know, because usually don't listen to him, but now you have to. All right, so two looks, then you get your break. In this case, Dakota has to listen since Blake says favoritism is out of the picture. I think I've made him earn everything he's got to this point, and we'll continue to make him earn it. You know, I'm not going to give him anything unless he gets it and, you know, works for it. It's all business out here. If I'm the best person, then I'll play. If not, then I'll probably be sitting. Sitting Dakota isn't in the plans for Blake, considering the talent his younger brother brings to the plate. We're talking about a guy who was on LSU's team for a season, then went to Northwest Florida State Junior College, where they won a national championship last season. For me here, my biggest hole was probably at third base, and so that's where I think we're going to stick in for now, is put him over there and see if he can do it. Um, but again, lots of energy and the leadership skills hopefully will, will take over for us, and he'll, he'll be a vital part of our team. A team that Dakota was all in on once his brother got the job, and now he wants to help rebuild the program into a winner. Definitely trying to help him out, help the program get to where it's supposed to be, you know, and definitely help the team accomplish its goals. Now, if it doesn't work out, both guys promise not to get mom and dad involved. Whatever happens out here is one thing. Once, once we're past this, we move forward from it and keep continuing to move forward as a, as a team. They tell them that whatever happens on the baseball field has to stay over here and that we can't take it home, duke it out, you know. <laughs> Sharif Ishak, WDSU News.